Baylor getting the win tonight. Uh, Goose is her name. She was the hero of the game, and she's joining us now. Yeah, Shelby McGlom joins us here on Sports Center, the hero of the big win for Baylor. Shelby, thanks for taking the time. I, I want to go through this methodically. I want you to take me through the end of the game. I need you to tell me what you were thinking when your teammate Taylor Ellis missed third base on what would have been the go-ahead run. Yeah, you know, when that happened, it kind of got us all down, but we realized that we still got another inning to play, and we were just going to go out there and continue doing what we've been doing all game, and that's hitting the ball and scoring runs, and we knew that we, were not, we weren't going to let that run uh, dictate the rest of the game. Well, you didn't, and so now we fast forward to the seventh inning, and you guys are down 5-3, two runners on base. You come to the plate. What are you thinking as you walk up to home plate? Right, after they walked Shelby, I knew that was kind of coming. Um, I just wanted to not necessarily go down without a fight. And so I knew once I got down, I mean, up 2-0, that the pitcher was probably going to give me something to hit. And so that's what I was looking for and just made things happen. Tell me what it's like when you're rounding the bases after you hit the ball and hit the go-ahead home run. Right. I was just super excited. I was pumped. Um, just wanted to give these seniors the last year to remember. You know, you, you just, you're, you're a freshman on this Baylor team, uh, and you've just lifted your your senior class back to the College World Series. What's this moment like? It's awesome. It's something that we've been working for all year, and that's what we've been saying all year as we wanted to get back to the World Series, and that's one thing that we um, had on our minds last night after the win, and we knew we were going to come out here and just give it all we had, and that's what we did, and we're just excited to keep going. Now, I've been calling you Shelby throughout this entire interview, but I've been told that I need to be calling you Goose. Where does the nickname Goose come from? <laughs> Right. It was a bedtime story when I was little that my parents used to read me every night. And so it kind of stuck through them, call me that, and then came to the softball world and then through high school. And there's two Shelbys on the team, so it's easier just to keep going with Goose. Well, listen, Ed, whatever you're doing and whatever they're calling you, they can keep calling you that because you're taking them all the way to the College World Series. And you can use this story <laughs> one day on your interview with the FBI. All right, you got it, Goose? <laughs> Yes, thank you so much. Shelby McLaw, the hero tonight. The Goose joining us here on SportsCenter. Oh, that was awesome. awesome I story, like her. Yeah. She's easy to, to, to root for, Goose. Uh, she's probably a little too young.